into your soul! Kind of an asshole, isn't he? And beyond that, he smells like a corpse somebody vomited up. I want to feed Shiv Spike to the sand grubs, but he stinks so bad they won't eat him. <laughs> Get some condiments. We gotta make Shivy look appetizing. Can't blame it. There is a treasure trove of guns anyway. Damn Leviathan's gonna kill us all.
Fine. Got some condiments? Great. Bring that stuff back here and we'll try to mask the stink. No closer to finding a trick. Next time you're bleeding to death, just think of death. Huh? <laughs> just slather shift spike in those condiments. It'll be gross, but at least uh, it'll. <laughs> I guess it'll just be gross. Your lungs will hold my future children! Great. Now just push them in and let the sand grubs do the rest. I am a sentient collection of hatred and... You know, I think I'm gonna miss him. Anyway, good job. Come on back. Actually, you know what? I don't miss him at all. <laughs>
Sir Hammerlock here with a bit of a job for you. I've heard tell some creature is sneaking around Hater's Folly, stealing treasure, slicing off faces and the like. Sounds terribly interesting. Hunt it down, would you? Sandman rather than do it myself. First of all, good question. Glad to see you, you know, taking the initiative. Second of all, Sandman's pretty strong and you're expendable as hell, so good luck. under the city of Oasis. <laughs> what a, a surprise! <laughs> oh, sorry, I hacked into your Echo device shortly after we met, so I can see everything you can. I get horrifically bored, and it's fun to watch you kill people. Who needs a medical license when you got style? Come on back anytime. Buy a gun already! Guns you don't need. You won't find better merchandise anywhere else. I made sure of that. I've always got. You stuck. Check back later. I'm always happy to take your money. It's a good thing no one in Oasis 
Thomas is dying of thirst. <laughs> Otherwise, the sight of that enormous spring might fill me with a tragic rage. <laughs> find this creature, please deal with it quickly. The poor fellow is evidently about the situation in the name of Jesse. Well, the creature wore his face like a jock strap. See about stapling Jesse's face back onto his skull.
back when Sandman and I were like this. Oh, right. You can't see through the radio. I'm crossing my first two fingers like this. Best buds. Until we stumbled upon some of Captain Blade's old notes about the lost treasure, that is. Together, Sandman and I found two pieces of Captain Blade's mystical compass. Then, because I'm an idiot, I tried to stab him in the back. Literally. The knife blade snapped, he shot me in the leg and ran. It was pretty embarrassing, but that's when I learned never betray your friends until you're sure you've got the upper hand. High quality, low prices, and no questions asked. Come back anytime. If you got the money, I'll save your gold earned life.
should have died when I told you to. Now you're gonna learn that big pain... ...comes from small packages! so we can get the third compass piece and be that much closer to finding the treasure. Catches your eye.
Always trust the gun at your side. Good news! You don't have to help me staple Jesse's face back on because he's dead. Hemophilia ho.
Three down, one to go. Once the compass is fixed, we'll find out where Captain Blade buried his treasure. I don't know where the last part of the compass is, but I know someone who might. His name is Herbert, and he lives out in the rust yards. Take that gift box over there. Hold on to that gift and don't give it to Herbert until I tell you to. Now go meet up with him. Off with you now. deserted the ship when Sandman attacked. Could you kill them, please? Deserters really bug me, since I only have one rule on my ship. If you join, it's for life. That and no fatties. <laughs> sorry, that was supposed to be a joke. I... Yeah, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> 